Hi there, Rob here, and I'm just going to take you through the basics of selecting and moving objects and parts of objects in Adobe Illustrator. The two tools we're going to be looking at are the two that live at the top of the toolbox, the black selection tool at the very top, and the one just below it, the direct selection tool. It can be quite easy to confuse the two and what they do, so hopefully this will get rid of some of that confusion to start with. So I'm going to select an object using the black selection tool. I just click on the object and the whole object will be selected and then I can click and drag by holding down the mouse and letting go to move it around the page. So the black selection tool deals with whole objects or groups of objects. If I click away from an object and click on nothing it will be deselected. If I go and click on the direct selection tool which is the white selection arrow and then I can go and click on parts of this object and start manipulating those. So I can click on this path here, this segment, and I can drag the whole line around and it will redraw the shape of the line depending on where I drag that curve. Or, and if I zoom in on this corner here, I can click on an individual point on that path and I can drag the point around or I can drag click and drag on the handle attached to any anchor point and I can drag that handle around to redraw the line there. If I click away with either of the selection tools no selection will be made and then I can click on another one of the tools. If I click with the black selection tool just zoom out there you'll see the whole object selected and I can move that whole object around on its own. So click away in between making selections always makes it easier to make a new selection. And then with the direct selection tool, this is where we select and move, manipulate the individual anchor points or the path segments in between.